Hello and welcome to 9th session of ASME B31.3 course. This is Ali and I hope you are doing well. Referring to previous session, now you know about the concept of design minimum temperature. In today's workshop, I'm going to illustrate how to use table 323.2.2 of ASME B31.3. This table is reference for requirements for low temperature toughness test for metals. You know, each material may have some test requirements based on its standard specification. For example, the manufacturer of ASTM A333 shall follow all test requirements specified in this standard and furnish related test certification. However, code may have some additional requirements further to a standard. The purpose of this table is specifying toughness test requirements in addition to tests required by the material specification. There are two rows in this table that materials are categorized into two main categories, listed materials and unlisted materials. Listed materials means materials which have been listed in table A1. Unlisted materials that not included in table A1 are not subject of this course. Therefore, we will focus on listed materials categorized in seven groups. You know that table A1 of ASME B31.3 used two methods for specifying design minimum temperature. First one is determining exact minimum temperature and second one is specifying letter designation. For better understanding, let's continue with first method via an example. You can find that minimum temperature is specified equal to minus 20 degree Fahrenheit for ASTM A369 grade FPB in table A1 of ASME B31.3 and this material categorized as carbon steel pipes and tubes. If we refer to a standard ASTM A369, we find that material describes as a standard specification for carbon and ferritic alloy steel forged and bored pipe for high temperature service. So we want to know about the requirements for low temperature toughness test for metals. Go back to table 323. 0.2.2 at the first step we should determine the group of material in first column ASTM A369 grade FPB belongs to group number 3 of this table next step belongs to your decision if you want to use this material at minus 20 degree Fahrenheit or warmer than it you should refer to column A and for design minimum temperature colder than minus 20 degree Fahrenheit you should use column B let's assume that or design minimum temperature of or piping component is minus 15 degrees Fahrenheit. It means that this component will be operated at warmer than minimum temperature specified by the code. Therefore, we shall refer to column A in this case. Column A is separated into two columns for this material. A base metal and B weld metal and heat affected zone has. You can see that base metal is specified by no additional requirements. Therefore, you can use this material at temperature minus 15 degrees Fahrenheit and warmer than without impact test. To continue, it's better to talk a little about welding. When two pieces of metal welded together, we have three zones, based metal, has, and welded metal. ASME B31.3 defined has in this way heat affected zone that portion of the base material which has not been melted but whose mechanical properties or microstructure have been altered by the heat of welding brazing soldering forming or cutting go back to table for weld metal and heat affected zone has 
We shall follow some requirements. If minimum temperature that is specified by table A1 is less minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 29 degrees Celsius. As you remember, the minimum temperature is specified as minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit for this material. Therefore, there is no additional requirements for wells, metal and heat affected zone has. If we want to use this material at temperature minus 30 degrees Celsius, we must refer to column B. Based on B3, generally, base metal shall be heat treated, and then base metal, well deposit, and hose shall be impact tested. Please follow the instruction again for another material. For ASTM A333 grade 6. Minimum temperature determined equal to minus 50 degrees Fahrenheit. This metal categorized as carbon steel pipe and tubes in table A1. Referring to a standard, we can find this description. A standard specification for seamless and welded steel pipe for low temperature service. If we want to use this material at design minimum temperature warm than minimum temperature specified in table A1. For example, at minus 30 degrees Fahrenheit, based on table 323.2.2, there is no additional requirements for base metal. However, minus 30 degrees Fahrenheit is colder than minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit. So, weld metal deposit shall be impact tested. Please note that reviewing all exceptions is not the subject of this course. It's your duty to study all cases and exceptions in the real project to ensure following code requirements that may use as a relaxation, that may reduce the cost of project. By another example, the purpose of this episode will be fulfilled. The minimum temperature of ASTM A312 grade TP321 categorized as stainless steel pipes and tubes in table A is minus 425 degrees Fahrenheit. This material describes in ASTM as a standard specification for seamless, welded, and heavily cold work asthenetic stainless steel pipes. This material belongs to group 4, asthenetic stainless steel of table 323.2.2. If design minimum temperature of ore pipe is equal to minus 300 degrees Fahrenheit, we should use column A. For base metal, we should follow A4 that says A. If 1. Carbon content by analysis greater than 0.1% or 2. Material is not in solution heat treated condition, then impact test in accordance with paragraph 323.3 for design minimum temperature less than minus 29 degrees Celsius or minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit except as provided in note 5 and 6. I'm going to explain this clause. Generally, it says that in case that design minimum temperature is lower than minus 29 degrees Celsius and carbon content by analysis is greater than 0.1% or 2, material is not in a solution heat treated condition impact test in accordance with paragraph 323.3 is mandatory let's check this condition for our example the design minimum temperature is lower than minus 29 degrees celsius therefore we shall check next two conditions referring to material standard carbon content is 0.08% that is lower than 0.1% therefore the condition 1 is not valid in addition based on a standard all pipes shall be furnished in heat treated condition therefore the condition 2 is not valid too and there is no need for impact testing for base metal but for B Weld metal deposit shall be impact tested in accordance with paragraph 323.3 because design minimum temperature is less than minus 29 degrees Celsius or minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit. If design minimum temperature of pipe is 
minus 450 degrees Fahrenheit, we shall refer to column B based on B4. Base metal and weld metal deposits shall be impact tested in accordance with paragraph 323.3. I hope you find this workshop beneficial. In next episode, I will show you how to use figure 323.2.2a for materials that minimum temperature of them is specified by letter designation in table A1. Thank you for being with us. Have a good time.